Okay guys, before the video starts, please make sure to go to Discord and under the development category, there should be a channel called Framework and there should be a file that you should download. Here's a reference image of how it's supposed to be set up in Roblox. And also please make sure that your HTTP and API services are turned on in your game settings. Hey guys, and I'm going to show you guys how to set up the ATM system version 3. So you should have three files in total the atm system the notification system and the framework so you just want to set up the framework in the required spaces so like this has to go into the replicate storage but i already have mine set up so just make sure it is set up like this and once it's set up like that you're good to go now you just want to take these two folders and paste it underneath the systems folder in the framework so I already have a notification system, so I could just delete the next one. You don't want to have multiple of those. Okay, so now you just want to go under the readme here. You will see a ATMs folder. You just want to cut that and paste it into the workspace. So as you can see, the ATM is here now. Um, over here it has a tool you can put in starter pack or into whatever team if you have a criminal team or a, a civilian team that you want to be able to rob the bank you could just put that in okay okay let's see if it works okay so i can make a deposit and i can make a withdrawal you could also set up game passes by cash and game so like this for example okay as you guys can see that works you could set it up in whatever way you want you can also transfer cash to other players in game and there's actually a mini game to rob the ATM so you have to guess like numbers and yeah so as you guys can see I only got two correct but it's a mini game where you could rob the ATM but to configure the ATM, you just want to go into the config tab here. And you'll see all these options here. You can change many things. But yeah, if you guys require any further assistance or any type of assistance with setting up this product, feel free to contact us in the Discord. 